Okay, let's pour a 4.3 liters. Uh, I'm using 5W20 fully synthetic. Basically, what we are going to do is just fill up this, then run the car, and let's check if there's a huge leak coming from the bottom of the car. This, it's really, I really surprised <laughs> that only had a one liter of engine oil after two months of oil change. So there must, there sh must, should be a huge leak somewhere. And that's the one we are, we are going to look for. Okay. So 4.3, we will be, should be, leave one liter, should be in here. 4.3 we're gonna leave 700 grams a little bit more okay we already put 4.3 liters engine engine oil and now moment of truth okay let's check the dipstick <laughs> look at the dipstick now we got some oil in there. I don't know if you could see it. See that? Okay, let's start the car. Let's start the car. Okay. Let's let's oh it's still connected, so let's get up from here. Okay. And then okay. Yes. Let's get up from here. So let's do it again. So Honda Where's that Honda? Honda Okay loading so 16 pin okay okay so let's press this so we still had that P3400 okay so it's, it's stuck off so let's press enter okay So let's go on data stream, manually select, I want to check the front, where was that, okay, where are you, front, rocker arm, this one, and then I need also the rear okay hmm. that's the rear and then let's try this too rocker arm well there go press okay and then let's see oh they are all off but look at the the pressure right now it's went up to 62 <laughs> a while ago I think it's 14 so there's some changes but I don't know why the front rocker arm pressure switch still off so maybe let's warm up the car so it's still off see that but there's some changes on the oil pressure 
so it's uh, more than f 55 a while ago I, I remember this 14 I think 14 PSI so there's uh, changes in here but I want to see this oil pressure switch how come it's not turning on it's always off but anyway I'm gonna test drive this car and let's see how it goes. I'm just gonna put or oh, put back the tire, everything, and then let's uh, test drive this car. Okay, uh, we are going to test drive the car, but before that, we are going to delete, delete that uh, check engine light. And I notice the pressure is already on 23 psi. I don't know if that's normal. But anyway, I'm going to delete, clear the fault code. Alright, I already uh, cleared the code, so okay. Okay, let's just test drive the car. Uh, I guess this is the best way to determine if we really fix this car. Let's wait if the check engine light on will come back. So let's drive this for a couple of minutes. If we can drive it for 30 minutes, then much better. So let's drive it. Okay, guys. See that? It's already on. <laughs> nice. Oil switch is already on. The rear one. I hope you could see that off so it's turning on and it's turning off sorry bro uh, hold on guess I'm I'm turning right I have to see that it's turning on so meaning the rear rocker on pressure switch it's it's working now waiting for the front one still off but I did saw it's on a while ago it's just that it's so hard to take a video while your car is you know running actually this is illegal <laughs> see it's all on okay I think this is already fixed one more round and let's see and also if you see the pressure going down to 17 16 but then as soon as you run if the car runs it will go up so i'll show it to you so that's oh boy sorry about that see that 43 51 it's going up so everything is working now So I think that's already a fix and then the car runs good no check engine light on came back so I've been driving this for I think almost 15 20 minutes now so I guess it's a fix so all my input is working the pressure switch on the rear on the front they're all the working the the pressure goes uh, from 17 all the way to 50 psi so that's good um, I guess that's it uh, let's give this uh, to the customer and if ever the check engine check engine light on came back then let's diagnose it again and for the leak that's gonna be a different uh, video I'm gonna make another video for that but a while ago I did check I don't see any large leak so that's it uh, if you had any question any suggestion uh, please comment down below and consider like and uh, subscribe my channel too that's all for today and see you on my next video bye bye